Hello and welcome. In this video, we'll see how to use and benefit from capacity projections in PowerProtect DD Management Center. To start, we log into the DDMC GUI using sysadmin credentials. In the left pane, select Capacity and then Systems. Here we see that we are managing three data domain systems. At the top, we have capacity threshold filters that indicate how many DD systems are OK, how many are flagged with a capacity warning, and how many are in a critical state. We can filter the systems based on these capacity thresholds. For example, if we select critical, we find that there are indeed no systems listed that match that state, so we can clear that filter. Of the three DD systems shown, the bottom one was recently deployed, so it doesn't yet display any capacity projection data on the system. When we select Calculate Projections for that DD system, DDMC reports that a projection can't be made because there is no usage data on which to base a projection. Let's select another DD system and examine its capacity projections. Here we have projections for the DD that are based on its weekly growth. Importantly, it displays the exact dates when the capacity of the DD will reach warning, critical, and then full capacity. These projections are based on past data ingestion, and actual results can vary. We also have a graphical representation for the capacity projection with slide bars. As we move the slide bar to the left to narrow the range, it changes the physical capacity projection data on the right. We can also choose a predefined projection timeline filter, such as 3 months, 6 months, and so on. When we select a predefined timeline, say 9 months, we see that the projection for available space at that time frame gets updated. We can also specify an exact date. The time to full column shows when this DD system's full capacity will be reached. Clicking the arrow on the right displays more information about the selected DD, such as the model of the DD, the number of M trees it has, and so on. In the Percentage Used and Projection column, we now see the different colors in the dotted line to indicate when the capacity will reach warning and critical thresholds and when the DD will run out of space. To display those dates in the Used and Projection column, we click the arrow on the right. After making note of the dates, we filter the available column with custom dates. We can see that the red dotted column doesn't appear at May 21st, but it reappears when we select the date of May 23rd. In the DDMC GUI, using these methods to project capacity usage helps you plan capacity management in a better way. Thank you for watching.